Good morning. Praise the Lord for this beautiful new day. Amen. I pray you had sweet sleep and restful slumber. I know I did. Too much. Um, I'm going to read in your hearing a passage from the book of, or the letter to the Philippians chapter 4, verses 6 through 8. That says the word of God. Do not be anxious about anything, but in every situation, this is not my version. Hold on. I know it is not my version. All right, here we go again. Be anxious for nothing, but in everything by prayer and supplication with thanksgiving, let your request be made known to God. And the peace of God, which surpasses all understanding, will guard your hearts and minds through Christ Jesus. Finally, brethren, Whatever things are true, whatever things are noble, whatever things are just, whatever things are pure, whatever things are lovely, whatever things are of good report, if there is any virtue and if there is anything praiseworthy, meditate on these things. Bless God this morning. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Let us pray. Thank you, God. Hallelujah. This is the day that the Lord has made. We will rejoice uh, and be glad in it. Oh, Lord, our Lord, our Lord and our God, we rise this morning to say thank you. Thank you for this brand new day, this unique day, this day that we have never seen before, we'll never see again, that you took the time to create, God. Hallelujah. The skies, the birds, the water movement. It is a beautiful day. And we thank you, God. We thank you, Lord, for keeping us through the night so that we could witness with our own eyes this brand new day. And Lord God, I rise this morning lifting up to your hearing my petition, my intercession for the great people of Greater St. Paul and friends. Hallelujah, God. I pray for thee. Under the sound of my voice this morning, God, near and far. And God, I pray that their continued uh, faith, I pray for their continued commitment to the cause of Christ. And I, and I pray their continued protection for today, Lord God. I pray that no hurt or harm will come near them today, God. And I pray that they'll hear your voice today, God. That as they journey throughout this day, that that, that that they'll take the time to look for you in all things. Hallelujah, God. Because you are omnipresent, you're everywhere and in all things. I pray that on today that they'll take the time, they'll make the time to sit before you, to sit at your feet today, to commune with you today, God. Hallelujah. To grow in relation with you, God. God, speak to their spirit today. Speak to their very souls today. I pray that their spirits will be so sensitive today that they just feel your presence, your holy presence with them today, all day, Lord God. I pray that today their hunger and thirst will become ravenous and arid after your righteousness, God. I pray that on today, their desire to please you and the newness of life is prioritized all day, God. Hallelujah. And in the name of Jesus, in the authority of Jesus, in the power of Jesus, hallelujah, I speak life over these thy people on today. I speak the joy of Jesus over these thy people. I speak your unsearchable, your incomprehensible joy over these thy people for today, Lord God. I pray that on this day, this day will be like no other day for Jesus, that on this day, God, They'll receive new revelations. They'll receive new graces, new mercies, God. I pray, Lord God, that on today, these our people will know no lack, that they will hear no negative thing that resonates in their spirit and soul on today. I pray, Lord God, that this new day will bring new joy. Hallelujah. I pray that they'll receive new inspiration today inspiration to be the best version of themselves for your glory today hallelujah so that they can be the best representatives of your kingdom hallelujah god that on today they'll see every single opportunity you present before them today to be peacemakers to be grace givers 
to be mercy givers, hallelujah, to be examples of your love and light that they'll walk through this day, hallelujah, <clears throat> with game-changing uh, motivations and attitudes today, God, that they'll be your living witnesses to, to, to the power and glory, to the purpose of a holy God, that on today, Lord God, that they'll they'll be that example, that love and light that that one can only get from the one and only true living God. Hallelujah! Let that not their continent, not their joy, uh, be confused by others with anything that they can get from this world. Hallelujah, God! Uh, I pray that they'll be your living witnesses today. That other people will 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 hear them and know how good and great. Uh, the Most High God is, hallelujah, that they'll tell of the goodness and greatness of the Most High, of the one and only true living God, of the Lord God Almighty, the, 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 the true God, hallelujah. God, hold them today in your holy hands. Whisper words of comfort in their ears to those who need to be comforted, hallelujah, that need to be comforted. Hold on to those who have no hope so that they know that their only hope is in Christ Jesus. Hallelujah, God. Those that are wavering and vacillating, God, I'm praying for a, a sturdy, solid foundation that they'll know that Jesus is the only way, the only truth, the only life, despite what the world might be trying to convince them uh, that of different avenues of ways to God, God, that your word has not changed, that your word has not been edited. Uh, hallelujah, that the Lord Jesus is the only way. The Son of God is the only way to the Father. Hallelujah, God. Hallelujah, God. Increase the discernment today. Increase the gifts and graces today, Lord God. In the name of Jesus, I declare and decree that they will suffer no hurt or harm from the enemy on today. That every plot and plan, scheme and scam the enemy might try to form against them will fall and fail. Hallelujah. I pray that these thy people will bless the Lord God today at all times, that, that your praise will remain in their mouth. Hallelujah. Because these are your people and you are their God. I pray that on today, they'll be givers of your love and light, Lord God. That on today, they'll not know despair, that they'll not know self-doubt, that they will not know defeat, but only victory in Jesus. I, uh, that on today they will win, uh, that today they will know healing, that today uh, they will know your peace. I pray that on today that these our people will love and be loved beyond any other day. Bless them all and each on this day, God, to overflowing. I pray that today their storehouses will be stocked, their vats will be filled, that everything their hands touch will be blessed or overflowing, that everywhere they go, they just will be on fire for you, God, and obviously filled with your love and light till it overflows and pours out onto others who they might engage with, who they might transact with, God. Let them be your living witnesses, God, on today. I pray that your glory cloud fills every space they occupy, that your angels will forego before them and that your goodness and mercy will follow up behind them all day to day, God. We love you and we know that you love these our people. Let us be strengthened on this day with your holy strength. May your strength hit everywhere that we are weak because your word says your strength is perfected in our weakness, God. For all things that that we can't do, we, we just pray for endurance. For all things that we don't want to do, we just pray for courage. Hallelujah. I'm lifting them up for holy boldness today. Hallelujah. Holy boldness in their continents, in their attitudes, in their motivation, in their emotional state, God. A holy boldness that there's nothing they can't do uh, with Christ Jesus. Hallelujah, God. That don't walk with that confidence, the confidence in Christ uh, as they continue in the cause of Christ. This is my prayer for these thy people. We love you today, God. We'll be careful to give you every honor, every glory, and every praise. It's in the mighty name of Jesus that I pray. And every glad heart says, Amen. 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 I love you all because I love you each. Bye.